So why women are protected? Being protected is slightly a curse because then your children. <laughs> so it's not a nice, nothing nice about this result. Uh, what people are now trying to do is to make mouse models of autism, take genes. The trouble is that the cases, uh, well, let's just show you one. Well, that most of autism will probably be due to a mutation which is just new and uh, isn't the same as a pre-existing change. Well, let me go on to the second. Oh, and you can just see, uh, now there's a, a second complication, or a real complication of autism, is there's a, now, there was a, a condition called Asperger's syndrome, where the children have normal intelligence, but very poor social interactions. And now that's called a type of autism. And it's more common than conventional autism. And so the frequency of autism, which was used to be said was one in a thousand uh, children, it gets close to one in a hundred if you include Asperger's. So these are people who uh, are obsessive, don't interact well with other people, but can be sometimes extremely bright. And the ratio of boys to girls is 10 to 1. Uh, uh, people have written uh, that Bill Gates is Asperger's. So, you know, he, he, he enjoyed computers as opposed to people. So, whether it's true. And uh, whether it's right or wrong, some people now are writing that Einstein was possibly a little autistic. And it may be true that half of the really talented mathematicians are somewhat Asperger's. So there's a connection between uh, Asperger's syndrome and mathematics, which will be very interesting to work out. Because some mathematicians are very good with people. But even when I was a boy, I was told that mathematicians were strange. <laughs> so uh, I think uh, there's probably some truth to it. Uh, the most extreme are the idiot savants who can do these fantastic calculations and who virtually are hopeless by themselves. They, they're uh, 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 idiot, you know, you call them idiot. <laughs> so, uh, so to me, it's possible that there's been a selection against mathematical ability in many societies because it makes you worse with people. <laughs> so it's a, we're just at the beginning of studying it. Okay. Uh, yeah, oh, these are just uh, two kind of, And initially we thought these copy number were about 10% of, of autism. But now we're still with the DNA chip technology lets you look at smaller and smaller copy number variations. And it may, it's certainly going to be at least 30%. Uh, so, and maybe 50% if you, the small ones are harder to study. So, Half of sort of human gen genetic disease may do due to these sort of changes, and the other half of the more conventional type where one base changes into another. But if you want to work at the genomic level, uh, DNA sequencing has been until recently uh, too expensive. 
But a big change is that uh, we'll soon, we, through copy number variation, we will discover regions of DNA which if they're uh, removed or too much of, lead to autism. And uh, then we will sequence uh, large numbers of autistic people to see how much of autism is caused by conventional mutations. Uh, so that 10% we may go down to 50% as the technology gets better. Okay. Yeah, okay. That's what <laughs> sort of think we're going. And a lot may be SNPs that haven't been discovered. So we'll, we'll see. So. Uh, so many of uh, autism, the inherited, heritable ones are when the gene is first inserted into uh, a woman. Then it, it, it can be inherited. <laughs> 